whips and you never get sick of nose wheel eclipse then I have got a present for you it's a video blog from Mr. BQ do yourself a favor and tune in to his YouTube Oh my lanta! <laughs> How many ducks is that? All the ducks. All the ducks. Yeah, you're right. All the ducks. What kind of silly question was that? One video. Good girl. Capish? Say it. Say capish. Are you my new mechanic? I'm my mechanic. You're my mechanic. I'm dialing your forks in. You're dialing my forks in, huh? Yeah. All right. That makes sense. That makes sense. Getting our stuff loaded up. We got our sleds. We got everything. You ready to sled? Ready to go racing. As if we clear our pit spot, we need a pit and shovel. Yeah. Is your mouth cold? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's driving a Tesla hands free, the new Tesla truck. Safety so, first. So we were discussing on the drive to that way to to Iowa. Which way are we going? Left or right? We're going straight. Uh, first. <laughs> we're getting enduro cross practice on the road because leading up to this event, I have about zero and a half amount of practice. And what's your training like for this event, Brett? I haven't ridden uh, enduro crash since about 2011, actually. Where, uh, well, I'll just show you guys. Yeah, roll the uh, beautiful crash footage right here. Ah! That was legitness. Yeah, it was. Huh? And that's Brett's last race. <laughs> Uh, chest into the crossbar pad, folded down into the other part of the bars. The bars were just folded. My collar almost folded. I didn't even get to do the freestyle part that, well, the whip session that I uh, signed up to do that night. The ramp was there. Oh, they had whip session? wasn't there. <laughs> well, don't worry. Enduro crash. So you got that one race under your belt. That's your training. I used to race enduro cross professionally. Sounds weird to say that now. Uh, but I've broken a lot of bones and not been able to move since that happened. So my training for this event is I have skipped 30 miles this year. <laughs> Skipping. Wait, hey, didn't you win this event a couple years ago? Yeah, the year before I broke myself into all the pieces, I won the I won this thing. So I'm going to use my knowledge, give it to him because I can't control a full-size motorcycle anymore. I got a pit bike right there. Yeah, it's that uh, little, little kid's bike. I'm going to race that. I don't even know if I can make a lap. He doesn't know if he can make a lap either. <laughs> edit, edit, <laughs> cut, cut. <laughs> you don't have any idea, do you? Uh, going through these towns, all Phil wants to talk about is just, oh, look at that rail. Look at that rail. Oh my gosh, I would slide that rail so hard. Oh, no, no, I, heck, I, I would slide it smoothly. Hard oh. is not what you want. The rail is hard. <laughs> what, would you, would you skim that one? <laughs> hey, could I skim your rail? <laughs> No, I'm just, I feel like I possibly want to start filming snow skiing again in the future, so I'm trying to, you know, get out in the countryside and see some spots and get some ideas. Right there, I want to rail slide that. It's a one stair handrail. Let's find the smallest rail. Like we're talking BQ's crotch size rail. <laughs> well, we are late for practice, so there's not a time for a gas station. Dude, I gotta go, man. Um, oh, he's. Yep, he's gonna turn this way. I'm gonna bend down. <laughs> Just checking the tires. So don't pull for. Oh! oh! Okay, now it's over my pants, and my pants are going in your truck. <laughs> you really regret this decision, but dang, does it feel good. Oh, yeah. It's probably a little wang in that shot. Oh, I mean, not a little wang, but a little bit of the wang showing. <laughs> okay, no rests. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, we're getting to this vlog thing, so I'm trying to make space. We just deleted about 10 minutes of video. It is filling itself up without taking any video. Hey, iPhone, you suck. I'm not taking videos, but it's filling itself up. So, in, in true BQ and me fashion, the track's literally like 
a couple exits down that way, but we decided to stop and go to the Mexican restaurant yeah, I first. Saw, I saw a Mexican place and I, <laughs> I saw queso was on the side. I'm all about that. Yep, time to get cheesy. <laughs> there it is, the Hip Hop, hip, hip, hip -hop Anonymous drone. Hip Hop, Hip Hop, Hip. I'll, hip, I'll let you hip, decide. It's a Hip Hop, Hip Hop Anonymous drone. Yeah, that's what we're racing. What are we doing here? Uh, I'm doing wheelies. I don't know what you're doing. You got to ride a no-name, made-up, homemade bike. I'm really hoping I don't do what I did last time. <laughs> oh, this looks awesome. Dude, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to have trouble walking through this stuff. Some holes or some patches. Oh, dude, we got this. At least it's smoother logs. It's really smooth. <laughs> oh. Okay, it's nice to journey. I got through quick. Yeah, you are, he's almost going down and we haven't even started the track walk barely. Good sign. Do it for Insta, bro. It's actually for Twitter. I only tweet now. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Enduro crash looking sick. I'm uh, pretty excited about this stuff. It's going to be way different. Um, being on the electric bike, that'll be different as well. But there's a couple of, uh, of jumps out here that are pretty... They're, they're bigger than I would have liked to have seen out here without seeing a ramp in front of it. But uh, yeah, I think we're gonna have some fun. Section the, uh, the rock section. Hey, that, that log section is probably gonna whip you, I think. No offense, man. They got a mini matrix coming right to the finish line. Pretty sweet. How about this next one? Yeah, I'm not doing the next one. You can have that one. <laughs> Sketchy. There's times you can hit this, it doesn't matter what you do, it yeah. just You're crashing. It's, it's, yeah. it's you crashing. might hit, you hit it one time, it's the easiest thing you ever did. Next, next lap, you did the same exact thing, yeah. And it should, and bah. Yeah. Although, right now, if you listen to the background, so he gets high on you. Is that Brush? Brush. It's Rush, the greatest rock band of all time. Now it's gonna be good. I'm excited about the race. It looks hard, it looks gnarly. Yeah, whatever, the track's crazy, big deal. I have to skip a mile in this iced out death trap out there after the race tonight. That's what I'm worried about. Training the boat's not good for when you're doing a lot of skipping. Not good at all. Why would you ever agree to something like that? Turns out it's unhealthy. Well, actually, this time it's healthy to hang out with the Nitro guys because they could do dumb bets like that. Yeah, healthy until you skip across the icy yeah, parking lot. Exactly, eat it. like you almost did without skipping. <laughs> and you, you did were, too. And I did. We both almost died not even skipping. Now I'm going to be skipping out there? How did practical, practice go? I don't think it went very good for either of us, honestly. <laughs> who, who fell more? You did, but you did more laps. I probably would have caught a few if I did more laps. I pretty much did one lap and said, I'm going to save my bike and my body just wait until the race. You only did one lap? If you had all my sections together, yeah, probably. How many times did you fall? None, but I stopped a lot <laughs> and pulled off the track a lot.
had a, had a little slippage during practice. Just slipped right off on me. Hi. <laughs> so Supercross. We're missing the missing the uh, maybe the race. I'm not really sure. The race could be started right now, but this is kind of important. Supercross is the race. We're riding like shh stuff out there, so I say we watch a little bit of this. And if we miss our race, it's you know cross that bridge when we get there. Why are you pushing your bike away, man? I didn't break the chain, but the master link came off. Oh. Donk. Oh, but yeah. donk. I was so bummed. I, I was like, I came out pretty good for the starting spot. I had last game thing. I still got a front row spot somehow. It was like all the way on the other side, but um, I still wasn't doing bad. And I was, I was looking forward to, to trying to put together a non-crashless moto again, but it uh, wasn't meant to be. So. Well, at least you didn't do it. The thing just fell apart. The chains happen, man. Well, here's the walk of shame right now. At least it's snowy and icy out. That's nice. At least I got my Hawaiian shirt on. <laughs> yeah, you're, uh, you're matching the setup pretty good right now. So here's the walk of shame back. Uh, I got a moto left, main, and then that sets a wrap here. The master we came off. Yeah, what an asshole built this thing. <laughs> what an idiot. He must. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's uh, him. He builds the bike. He does. Nothing better to do whenever it's 30 degrees out. See you later. Oh, yep. You're gonna pass me for sure. I'll pass you. Phil, I feel bad for him. <laughs> Travis is a bad influence. Just, just skipped right out of BQ's car there. He's stuck at the red light. I'm skipping. About time you decided to show up. It took you so long. <laughs> I'm waiting. Enduro crash nightcap donuts, chocolate milk. I didn't have all six of them. I gave, uh, I gave four away to some. Some guy in the lobby actually didn't film him, but Rock Morley <laughs> and Batman, the original. Solid. What time is it? It's uh, 11:48, so I got 12 minutes to do this. No, I got as long as it takes. This is a pretty long hallway. It's a good sign. I'll see you in about probably 20 or 30 of these laps. You're gonna see Wacky Joe down there I too. Know, so. All right, Phil, let's hear it. How did Enduro Crash go? Well, for me, it went bad, and for you, it went bad. So you do the math. <laughs> your bike broke, my bike broke, and you bled all over the bed. So here's your synapses. I'm not really sure what happened. I'm not really sure where it came from. I think from. what happened is you, you didn't win, and that, that's your prize. When you don't win, <laughs> you bleed on the bed. So for me, I rode four times and crashed eight. I don't know how that really makes sense, but um, I think I actually went one, uh, the LCQ that I didn't crash, that was the only time I rode that I didn't crash, and um, the other times I I ended up crashing a lot. So it was good, I even crashed one time, like I crashed in the rocks, and then I got up, and I actually crashed again before I started riding again. 
so it was pretty good. I like I was trying to whip both ways at the same time with the, without um, hitting a different jump. So it was good. That was uh, that was a fun time, and um, I'm glad we came. Stopped to get a little gas on the way home, but Phil didn't do a very good job of tying his bike up. What's up, dude? I thought the snow would hold it in place. <laughs> you got the snow on the fender looking good, man. Got the shovel there, though. How do you feel about the snow? You excited? Loving the snow. Loving yeah. it. Yeah, perfect. You can go, you can go sledding later? Uh, probably not. Looking to go shopping. Oh, well, that's good. That's better anyways. You guys have fun, though. You too. I got a chauffeur.